Good morning. Here with another video for the Little Bits of Lace 2024 by Cory Dahlman. I believe that's the name of it. And I'm going to make, I already made one to show you, a lace flip on a journaling card. I know it's kind of bulky, but I figured it's a journaling card so it can be taken out if you're going to write like on the page that's before it. So I didn't figure it would be too bad if it was a little bulky. And then I just put it in a belly band. You could put it in a pocket or probably clip it onto a page with a paper clip or something. But I'm going to make another one on camera. So that's the one I've already made. So I have some cardstock here and lots of pieces of lace. I wish I had time to do this every day. Man, I love working with lace. I'm sorry I did not put, um, I was going to put a cloth over my bucket. We sprung a leak last night in my craft room. I am so frustrated. Got all over some of my stuff. Hope it's not ruined. Let me see if I can cover that so you don't hear so many drips. I'll be right back. That didn't help. My cloth was too small and it fell in the bucket. Hopefully the drips aren't too loud and don't drive you crazy. Like, ah, I was going to get a towel and cover that, but... Let's see. I like a thinner lace underneath. Isn't this pretty? Because I didn't know these get are getting kind of bulky, but you can always take it out to write. Um, 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 um. We've been having really, really cold weather, like below zero. When my daughter said yesterday, she goes, hey, it got above zero today. It was like one degree. <laughs> but it did get above zero. And, But I don't think it's the pipes froze. We have um, um, my mom boiler heat. I have no idea how that works. But we've been having our... You know, letting our water drip at night in several of the places, and there's like this little rubber or plastic hose that runs along with the pipes for the um, heat, and it's that little plastic or rubber hose has must have a little hole in it. Let's see. What have I got here? Don't want that. Don't want that. Too much the same color. This one's a little different. It's too big. I cut it down. So i got to call the landlord today and have them Either come look at it or it sends some a plumber out or something to look at it. It hasn't ruined too much of my stuff, but I like to have my things in pretty decorated boxes and stuff so that my craft room looks pretty. Some of my pretty decorated boxes are not so pretty anymore. Don't know if I like that one. This is some lace I'd cut off of for another project. See, I'm really bummed because those boxes, I really liked how they had looked before they got soaking wet. 
I'm just glad my daughter saw it last night because our craft room's in the basement. I was already laying down for the night, and my daughter has her room in the basement, and she's yelling and yelling. I had no idea what was going on, and she's like, there's water dripping in the craft room. I don't know. I had something a little darker to go there. I don't think I do. So many of my laces are a lot of the same color. That's the same color. This one's a little different color than that. I don't know if you can tell on camera. Sometimes things look different on camera. That one might be a little darker. I've got a whole drawer here full of laces and things. Maybe if I talk you won't hear the drip so much, huh? I don't know. Yeah, that might look better. A little bit darker. Where's my ribbon here? My coffee dyed ribbons. Upstairs, I had jugs underneath the dripping faucets because I'm like, I don't want to just waste this water. I can use it for my watering my plants or for mixing with my coffee dye or something. So I put buckets underneath. Well, then you hear that, that drip, drip, drip. So then I put the fabric, some rags underneath the, the, um, or inside the, um, I had like the gallon, um, milk jugs. And I put cloth in there. That helped to reduce the sound a little bit. I have to really watch my time this time because one of my most recent videos I went too long and oh my goodness I didn't think I was going to be able to upload it or flip it. Flip it. I think that I like that white button on there, the waiter one. Get rid of these. I really like these. I'm going to have to see if I can make more. Be nice if I had a pearl button to go with that. I probably do somewhere, but not handy right here in my space. I guess I could always take it off since I am hot gluing it on. If I find one I like better later. Okay, so now I have to glue this all on. I can do it without messing it up and remembering what I did. I did hot glue on the other one, but I don't know, that must be a really low temp hot glue gun, or maybe it's got two settings, I don't know, because I barely got it on and it was hard and I couldn't get my, I had to tear it off, tear the glue off and redo my lace because then I had a big glob of glue at the top. And, huh. I see these people that are making videos and they put their glue down and then they talk for a while and I'm like, if I did that, mine would never stick. Okay, now I gotta get this bunch down here. So far, so good. Thank you to my new subscribers. I really appreciate it. It means a lot to have new subscribers. Hopefully you can see what I'm doing and I'm in frame and my fingers aren't in the way. There's that. 
put this down. I hope whatever's wrong with this is not a big deal because, oh my goodness, I have so many things stored down here. If we have to move things, it is going to be a royal pain. I think I will use hot glue for my little threads here. And I'll use hot glue for my button. Oh, cute, cute. All right, now I have to trim the bottom off. I'll get the lace out of the way here. It turned out a little different than I had kind of pictured it, but I like it. those up because I want to cut I don't want to cut those when I cut the other things off I want it hanging down from the card a little bit so they're not just all even Oh, that turned out really pretty. Let me put it in my pocket here. I put my lid on my glue. I don't know how many times I come down here and after making a video, I forgot to put the lid on my glue. Okay. There. I like that. Thank you so much for watching, and I actually did it in less than my time that I was going to do it in, so I'm glad for that. So again, thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing, hit the like button if you like this, and I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.